Hi guys, welcome back to our channel and in today's video we are going to help you determine the differences between pyranos and furanos. So basically these are both the ring structures that are present in uh, sugar molecules and uh, in today's video we are going to share the differences which can help you determine and distinguish between different types of sugars. So in pyranos we have um, six uh, we have a hexagonal structure in which we have five carbon atoms and one oxygen atom. So what you see over here is one oxygen atom and all these uh, points represent the carbon atom. Alright, so it is it has a hexagonal structure and it has five carbon atoms and one oxygen atom. And uh, this ring structure is present in most common used, most commonly used sugar, which is glucose. So glucose will have this uh, pyranose ring. And when you come to furnace, it has a pentagonal structure. So it will have four carbon atoms and one oxygen atom, as you can see over here. So the basic difference between um, these two uh, ring structures is that it this one is, an, is a hexagonal structure. This one is a pentagonal structure. There are five carbon atoms in this one four carbon atoms in this one and the common example the general example that you will come across for furnos is fructose because it has a furan ring in its structure so basically these both are the common uh, ring structures that you will see in different types of sugar and um, i hope this video helps you to understand the differences between pyranos and furnos it is basically the difference of carbon atoms uh, in the structure and which results to the different properties of the sugar molecules. I hope this video helps you to understand that and for more such videos on Lewis structure, molecular geometry, polarity of the molecules, make sure to subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching.